winter is coming. Might just be the cold. Winter is coming. It's cold outside. You don't know cold. Winter is coming for him. It's either me or this cold, and it doesn't appear to be going anywhere. The water system on the aircraft features a gravity purge system, which may be activated in the air or on the ground. For aircraft equipped with galley touch screens, the purge function is located on the water system screen along with on-screen instructions. The purge process is the same for both touch screen and switch panel equipped aircraft. In-air purge. Press and hold the system purge switch on the galley switch panel for three seconds. The supply drain purge valve, V2, will move to the system purge position and allow water tanks to empty. When the tank is empty, the V2 valve will return to the supply position and remain there until landing. Upon landing, the V2 valve will move to the drain position and all system valves will open to allow all supply and drain lines to empty. Ground purge. Press and hold the system purge switch on the galley switch panel for three seconds. The supply drain purge valve, V2, will move to the system purge position and allow water tank to empty. When the tank is empty, the system will pause for up to 60 seconds. The V2 valve will then move the drain position and all system valves will open to allow the supply and drain lines to empty. Remember, the conformal water tank requires 7 to 15 minutes to drain from full to empty. The automatic portion of the purge is now complete and the water system and system heat turns off. Water system, system purge, and system heat switches on the switch panel turn amber. In order to drain the lines, you will need to turn the water system back on. Pressure in the system will push out residual water trapped in the lines. At this point, Non-vented items must be opened to allow residual water to drain out of the supply and drain valves. Opening each of the following for a minimum of two to three minutes will allow air to enter the system and water to drain out through the supply lines. Galley faucet. Aft lavatory faucet. Forward galley coffee maker fill valves forward lavatory faucets that are not in fold-up sinks. Be sure to empty all ice drawers or close the drain valves located under each drawer. Cycle each coffee and or espresso maker until empty and flush each toilet at least twice. Empty all coffee containers. FlexJet has made it policy that the G450 will go through two purge cycles prior to securing the aircraft in below freezing temperatures. The second purge will only take a few minutes and once complete will reset and set all applicable water system valves for overnight in the extreme temperatures. After all the purge procedures are completed, check to make sure there is no residual water left in the potable water fill port before leaving the aircraft. 
This will ensure no water will freeze in the port that could damage the pipes or inhibit proper filling the next morning. Make sure the silver service port and the lock handle are stowed. Inspect and secure the potable water access door. A blue cast message will appear if the door is not secured properly. To ensure the water doesn't freeze as it enters the cold pipes, allow the system to warm up for 20 minutes prior to servicing the water tank. Do not turn on the water system. You will only need to press and hold system heat for 3 seconds to activate the system heater. After 20 minutes, add water to the conformal water tank. When the tank is full, turn on the water system and the main heater. Then open all faucets to bleed out any air in the line. When the water begins to flow steadily, turn on the lav and galley heaters.